Hey, what's good, y'all? So today we got some crazy news. So pretty much a 12-year-old student was being bullied at school and her mom brought her back to the school, actually to the school bus, to confront the other young person that was bullying her. And apparently, she handed her a gun and she told her, yo, go on a bus and handle what you gotta handle, which sounds pretty damn crazy. So this 12-year-old student came there with her mom. They had a gun. So apparently the mom and the daughter got arrested. And um, this video has been circulating all over social media. So pretty much much we're gonna watch this video i'm gonna give my opinion on it during and after the video please hit that like button for me before we get started i really appreciate that you know let's just check this video out and see what the hell is going on because again it sounds very crazy oh no! No! oh what the hell hold on hold on was she butt naked? Like, what's going? What's going on here? Why she got on a uh, bra and panties? Why she even? I got I got so many questions, man. I don't know what the hell is even going on right now. First of all, you you you're butt naked. Well, not butt naked, but you're naked enough. Like you around twelve year olds. You you you're at a school. You're at a school bus. Your butt cheeks is out. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know what type of outfit that is to be wearing to go to school with. And then on top of that, you you brought a gun to. All right, let's just let's just watch this, man, because I already know I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna be confused the whole way through. So let's just keep watching. She ain't got no damn clothes on. What the hell's going on? And she just handed. Oh man, got the damn babies crying. Get that out of my face. What the? Oh! Some scary moments when a young girl pulled out a gun after a fight on a school bus. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. I'm Cherie Skipson. And I'm Devin Bartolotta. The moments were captured on video, and tonight police say a 12 year old and her mother have been arrested. Eleanor Tabone has the story. It started as a fight between two girls on the school bus after school on Friday. Then things got heated. At some point, one of the girls gets off the bus at a bus stop, returning, pounding on the bus door to get inside, walking away with what appears to be a gun in her hand after the driver oh refused God. to open the door for her. I just can't picture myself sitting there with a, somebody approaching a bus with a gun. You should have pulled off for the bus driver. That was so irresponsible. Yeah, that's Christmas crazy, City Schools, man. the charter school operator that runs Achille, released a written statement saying, Crescent City Schools and Achille Academy are horrified by this brazen act of violence that happened off school campus. The student is not at school and we are working with NOLA Public Schools regarding disciplinary action. Eyewitness News spoke with a mother of two students who ride the same bus. When your children ride their bus, they should have put a clear through your head. What if you got on a bus? You would have shot those children? Eleanor Tabone, Eyewitness News. Dang, she was going to Police arrested the 12-year-old that same day and charged her with aggravated assault with a firearm. The child's mother was also arrested and charged with principal to aggravated assault and for contributing to the delinquency of the juvenile. Police have not exactly said what led to that charge. The children's name have not been released given the age of the girl involved. At the end of the day, I'm a woman of God, but I do not respect how my child is being held accountable for something that she was being bullied about. She was being bullied, oh, that's the so mom. that's why she pulled out a bird. Why would it? It was in her possession, though it was not supposed. Yo, this lady is crazy. What? Yo, I I get it. Nobody likes bullies, right? But they're 12, man. Like, you got to teach them how to better deal with situations. Kids got to learn how to communicate, talk about their problems. You know what I'm saying? You can't always put violence in their hands just because they have an issue with somebody. Especially a, a gun? Like, yo, what we doing here, man? Like, you want, you want kids to be shooting at each other? So you want your daughter to murder this girl 
because she was being bullied. How that sound? You and the girl and your daughter and the girl's mother could have had a meeting where y'all hash this out, right? It's, it's, these are little girls. Their problems can't be that damn deep. It's all it's little stupid stuff, you know what I'm saying? And you over here trying to justify it on Instagram talking about, oh, my daughter was being bullied, so I gave her the Glock. Like, this sounds crazy. Like, yo, what type of moms are these, man? Anyway, let's let's keep it going. It was to be in her possession. It was in her possession and she pulled it. I don't care how y'all take it, how ignorant y'all say I'm being or whatever, but when a child is under frustration and being bullied, she's supposed to have, have help and with self-defense or whatever. Y'all too ignorant in New Orleans. I said that. A Kelly Academy is very messy. Y'all children is messy. You need to put your children in their place because they play people too much. Nobody don't have time for to be playing with no fucking children all day. What in the world is this lady talking about, man? Self-defense, man? You, you, you making it seem like, you know, when you using lethal force, it's to defend against other lethal force. Like, what type of lethal force can this other 12-year-old present? That your daughter gonna need a, a Glock or what, whatever type of gun that was. What, why, what type of attack could she be defending against that she gonna need a gun to protect herself? And I'm, I'm assuming middle school. This ain't, this is just crazy as hell, man. Like I don't know what type of mothers they got out here now, but everybody claim to be a great mom and stuff. But this just, this is just gross negligence, man. But yo, let me know what y'all think about this one in the comments. I'm pretty sure y'all got a lot to say about this one, but um. Yeah, man, like I said, I appreciate y'all stopping by checking me out. Just please do me a favor and hit that like button, and I'll check y'all on the next video, man. It's your boy Ant Mo, and I'm out.